In this video, we will discuss about ITRS scenarios. We will discuss what is risk scenario, what is top down approach, what is bottom up approach, and which approach is best for developing risk scenario. Risk scenario. As we know, Scenario means there are various possibilities. Risk, some kind of adverse impact. So in short, a risk scenario is a process to identify various possibilities that can have some adverse impact on business objectives. It is a process to identify possible events that can have some adverse impact on business objective. Scenarios may be some events such as system failure, natural calamities, network unavailability or any other such events that can have impact on business operations. Risk scenarios are considered as most effective technique to assess the business risk. It involves interaction with business process owner and other experts who helps to estimate the frequency and impact of the risk. the approaches for developing risk scenario. Top down approach and bottom up approach. In top down approach, risk are considered from management perspective. In bottom up approach, risk are considered from process owner perspective. In top-down approach, risk events that can directly have impact on business goals and objectives are considered. Whereas in bottom-up approach, risk events that can have direct impact on their respective processes are given more importance. Top-down approach, higher level risk like reputational risk are considered management is more concerned about the reputation of the organization where in process owner risks related to their respective process for example system unavailability etc are considered question arises what is the best approach But obvious top-down approach is one of the important because it involves higher level of events and risk that impact the organization. But at the same time, we cannot ignore bottom-up approach. So both the approach should be used simultaneously as both are complementary to each other. Let us discuss some key aspects from exam perspective. Which is the most important factor to be identified in a top-down approach? As we all know, top-down approach is from management perspective. And management is always concerned about their objectives and goals. Which is the best approach for development of a risk scenario? Top down approach or bottom up approach? 
we discuss this combination of both as they are complementary to each other what is the most effective technique in assessing business risk risk scenarios in risk scenarios various possibilities are considered and some events are identified which can have some adverse impact on business they are considered to be most effective technique to assess the business risk what is the most important information in risk register that helps in developing a risk scenario potential threats if threats are not identified or not documented the risk management efforts may not be effective in what kind of assessment risk scenarios are used to estimate the likelihood and impact of risk threat and vulnerability assessment it is the process wherein various threats and vulnerabilities are identified and then the probability and impact are estimated to rank the risk to categorize the risk whether it's a high level risk medium level risk or low level risk let us discuss some practice questions most important factor in a top down approach for developing a risk scenario is to identify business objective best approach for developing a risk scenario is combining top down and bottom up approach for better synergy most effective technique for a risk assessment is risk scenario primary reason for a risk scenario enabling the risk assessment process is it helps to estimate the frequency and impact of risk
most important information in a risk register that helps the development of a risk scenario is potential threats. Primary factor on which a risk scenario should be based is threats faced by the organization. It is most relevant factor advice from top official is not a primary driver. Analysis of reported incident will not address new and emerging risk. Budget for risk response may not be relevant while conducting the risk scenario. Method that uses risk scenario to estimate the likelihood and impact of a risk is Threat and vulnerability assessment uses risk scenario to estimate the likelihood and impact of a risk. Other options do not use scenarios as such, wherein testing is done or audit is done on actual basis. Best method to provide comprehensive result by conducting qualitative risk analysis is scenario with threats and impact. With the use of possible scenarios, we can able to evaluate threats and impact in much better way and a more informed decision can be taken. Other options are not as significant or as important as scenario with threats and impact. Best method to estimate the likelihood of a risk event is scenario analysis. In scenario analysis, likelihood of a risk event is estimated. Other options are not used for estimating the likelihood of a risk event. Thanks for watching.